In this video, we're going to look at three values of central tendency. So central tendency will give you an idea of the middle of your data set. So the three we're going to discuss here are called mean, median, and mode. Start with mean. It's what you normally think of when you hear the word average. So you're going to add up all of the values and divide by the number of values. Now for the median, what you're going to do to start is you're going to place them in order, in particular in ascending order from least to greatest. All right, and then once you have them in order, the median will be the value that's directly in the center if there's an odd number of values. But if there's an even number of values, you can't get to a single number, you get to a pair of numbers. And so it's going to be the average of those two middle numbers. And the mode will be the value that occurs most often. Now if you think of a data set, there's a possibility of values not repeating. In that case, it's considered to have no mode. Now if you have two values that both occur, say, four times, and they occur most often, so you can't determine one's the mode more than the other, it's considered bimodal, and they're both modes. And you can have that occur with three or more values as well, and then it's called multimodal. So if we take that information and look at an example, we have data from a class, and the number of pages read by the students was 86, 84, 83, 84, 83, 86, 86, and 84. So if we first find the mean, we're going to add up all of those values and divide by 8 because there's 8 data values. You get 676 divided by 8, which equals 84 and a half. Now for the median, we first have to put them in order. Right, so our lowest number is 83, and then it repeats. So 83, 83, 84, 84, 84, 86, 86, 86. So now if we look for our median, we have 8 values. So there's an even number of values. So we're going to find the two middle numbers. In this case, it's the second and third 84s that appear in our data set. Because 84 is in position 4, and in the third 84 is in position 5. All right, so we take the average of those two numbers, which of course is 84. So now for the mode, you'll notice that putting them in order helps to see how often they occur. So for example, 83 occurs twice. 84 occurs three times and 86 occurs three times. All right, so the mode is the one that occurs most often. 84 and 86 are tied with three occurrences. So this is going to be called bimodal with modes 84 and 86.